Oh, there we go, bit of tug of war. From a behavioural point of view, as you could see there, both of them actually lying with their backs towards us. It just shows you that they really are very comfortable with the vehicle. We pretty much part of the scenery at the moment. Obviously, a good thing to know. We're not interfering in any way, nor we're changing their behaviour. They're behaving as if we weren't here, and that's one of the beautiful things about this area, Sabi Sands, Juma. Again, it's something I mention every now and again because it really is something to be appreciated. Is not only how close we get to animals, but they are so habituated that their behavior doesn't change. So the fact that we're sitting, looking at this line right hand side, he's probably his backside is only about five, six feet away from the car's front end. Both these lions are within a few meters of us and they behave exactly as if they would have behaved if we weren't here. And that is obviously amazing because you really get to have a sort of a personal insight or an intimate insight into what these animals do in their daily life. And that is worth a lot. The behavior we get to experience here is very special.
Now and again, when they pull it like that, the smell just sort of wafts out towards us again, and <coughs> you have to sort of breathe carefully. Uh, you said you're looking for these many later models they eat at the moment. Copy, copy. Whew. Different smell coming through. eggs with each other as soon as they come too close is that as you could hear they're more growling but obviously they work together coalition just to remind you again these two guys the more I look at it the more I'm actually guessing that they'll be cousins rather than brothers just from the physical size aspect or the difference in size and also the mane but either way around whether they're cousins or brothers they would have spent time together since cubs since young they would have learned uh, to play together and hunt together and even were nomads together where they really would, ah, they're sort of semi-nomads at the moment still. They've got a territory certainly in terms of how they behave but they don't have a fixed, what is he looking at? He's <laughs> just like he noticed something there, strange. But yeah, they um, literally help each other in all ways, everything from catching food to fighting off other lions and hyenas so even though there's a bit of aggression between them it's maybe just in their nature more than anything else it's not really something that they're gonna kill each other occasionally you might have a bit of a fight between the two just to you know, sort of remind each other of how strong they are 